Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you how to use uh, code code point from uh, the string API. So first of all, I'm going to quickly launch IntelliJ. There we go. Once IntelliJ is open, so that Create new project, Java. I'm going to be using Java 11 for that one. Or Java string code point store. There we go. All right, once open, I'm going to create a new class, which is going to be our main. Good. So from there, we're just going to do PSCM, which is the equivalent of public static main, and we have a string, for example, string um, code point. Code string is equal to hello. So code point is usually used for when uh, you need to convert any characters into its ASCII equivalent, meaning that saying that char h um, there you go. Uh, put string dot char at zero it's going to return that one and if we print that there you go we're going to get just each value h okay so from there, we can do code string. H hmm. is equal to that plus code string dot code point at index zero, and we're going to get the equivalent of. Which is 72 in the ASCII table. So if, for example, you have that now, you can save it into an integer, code ASCII val is equal to copy. So, okay. Now to convert it back, I'm going to do string h val string So you're going to get an error. This is where we have to do where we are doing a typecast and that's a little nifty trick 
Oh, so just putting a st string in the front to convert any char value into um, into uh, a string. So as out h original. H file string. There you go. And now you got your ASCII value back. So if you want to do it for all of them, you could create a, you could, for example, create a, an array of chars, let's say char. Uh, not even actually, you can even just do an int, an array of int where you store. So int val array is equal to arrays dot what am I writing? Uh, code string dot split. to zero and trouble int uh, i less than int um, dots length i plus plus we increment and now we're gonna do Uh, int val at i is equal to code string dot char at i. It's just going to fill up everything. So if you want, you can do it. Int val r. Here dot there you go. So you get the address of uh, in memory this string if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so then you do to make sure that you're printing everything right. So it's int var at i. Just so you don't have to retype and reprint everything. There you go. So now that we've got all the values, 72 as before, uh, 101, 108, 108. 111 and that's the ASCII value and then you can do the same thing as we've done before to convert it back so for for I Let's 
Daneben. And then can I do new string plus equal same thing as we've done here. But instead of that, we're going to write int by at i. Now we can just print out the string. There you go. Here are the values of the ASCII, the ASCII values, and then you get it back as the original string. Hope that was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment at but at the Don't forget to subscribe. Oh.